All right, everybody, I'm gonna try to get through this video, but I've already done like nine takes and it might not happen because there's so many people around right now. Yeah, you. But I wanna talk about how important it is to get a second opinion on stuff because I recently experienced this and in my case, it was the dentist for my kids. So I took my kids to the dentist, George and Luigi. Yeah, and Giorgio ended up having a couple cavities, which I was really bummed out about because he's only five. And we don't do lots of juice or sugar or anything. So I was just, I was sad. But anyway, I asked, you know, what do we do then? Where do we move forward? Is it cool because those teeth are just gonna fall out anyway? Or do we, you know, do we fill them or whatever? So he, the dentist said, there's two options. One, you can knock them completely out and get them all done at the same time. Or you can do the freezing and do them a few at a time. But he mentioned that with freezing and children and freezing, they don't always react the best way. And I totally get that. I don't know about you, but when I go to the dentist and they freeze my mouth, I get anxiety and my, you know, your throat feels like you're, it's closing up. So I understand how kids wouldn't understand what is happening to their bodies and have that reaction. So here I am sitting at the dentist going, what am I going to do? I have to knock out my five-year-old to get these cavities filled for teeth that are going to fall out anyway, but not until he's 11. I didn't know what to do. I was really upset. And so I decided to get a second opinion. So I called one of my mom's friends because I wanted to get a second opinion. Guys, with the anesthetic and with all, like the freezing and everything, it was going to be $4,000 to have his teeth done. $4,000 for a five-year-old's teeth. So I said, no. I went to this other dentist and we sat down and he said to me, you know, people get freezing because they don't like being uncomfortable, even if it's for one second. And the size of these cavities are not big. He might not even notice if we do it without any freezing at all. And beautiful office, amazing dentist, very well known. And I said, oh, okay, yes, let's try it. And so the first, we did it in a couple sessions, but we first day go in, he gets two done, watches How to Train Your Dragon, and didn't even notice that anything was going on. I was actually watching Brooklyn Nine-Nine. You were watching Brooklyn Nine-Nine at the dentist? Yeah, on, on Netflix. On Netflix, he, okay, he was watching Brooklyn Nine-Nine <laughs> on Netflix. Got his teeth done, no freezing, didn't even make a difference. He didn't even care. Hey Georgie, did you feel anything or did you care? Not really. Like, yeah. A kind of both. Kind of both. So bottom line is don't feel bad if you want to get a second opinion on stuff. If you have the time, it might be worth it. And in a lot of ways. Right, Luigi? Say hi. Hi. Okay, you guys, have a wonderful Sunday. Can you say that? Have, have a great a, Sunday. Have a great Sunday. <laughs> We're going to go outside now and do some gardening or, I don't know. Bye. Something.